Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Anastasia back at it with another awesome video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Now as you can see from the title of today's video, today I'm going to be doing a trend that must fall, trends that we don't want to see in 2021 and I actually went on Instagram and I asked you guys what are those annoying trends that you really want to leave in 2020. Trends that you really don't want to take in 2021 and I went to Instagram and I did a poll on that and you guys commented so I'm going to be answering those comments and yeah if you are new here please do subscribe if you are a regular degular thank you so much for tuning into my channel please don't forget to like and subscribe and ring on that notification bell not to miss anything that I post and today we are gonna be drinking the wines because you know I'm gonna be talking a lot so I'm just gonna need something to <laughs> downside but do a grand so I decided but Mandy grand, this puzzle of the wines and hear not the vibes so let us do that so as I said I went on to Instagram and I asked you guys what are some of the trends that you really don't want to see in 2021? Like trends that are just up to here. Like I've had it with those trends, you know. And I'm going to be commenting on those. Um, quick disclaimer. I'm not saying that you should throw away your clothes. I'm not saying that um, your clothes aren't nice. I'm not saying that, I don't know, you should throw away your clothes and not wear them anymore. No, darling. This is just people's opinions and I'm just going to be answering them and just giving my two cents on them just adding my input and whatnot and if i agree i'll say that i agree and if i don't agree i'll say that i don't agree okay so now let's get into the trends that must fall <laughs> um the first one is <laughs> the first trend that you guys said must fall is the cocktail dress the famous cocktail dress I'm guessing it's that um, the Instagram famous dress the lockdown level one dress I feel like we've had enough of that dress um, that dress needs to go if you were thinking of buying that dress a boat a boat mission if you were thinking of buying that dress for Christmas or New Year's please don't buy the dress it's overrated and we are tired of seeing it yes it looks good on everyone but no honey please don't even try it don't even buy it because we are over it we don't want to see it like it's cancer is pelile like I remember like it trended for like a week a week straight like from Monday to Sunday everybody was wearing that dress and I was like, hey, well, yes, I was tempted to buy it because <laughs> it's nice. But man, Jimmy, this boy is on any man. She can't even corner. Model is wearing a dress. Man, it's in it. Model is wearing a dress. No, I don't vibe with that. Like, I wouldn't be able to cope. I wouldn't be able. So if you are thinking of buying that dress, a bought. Like, don't ever, like, don't, don't buy it. It's out of fashion. Like, it was in, it's out. The second. Let me sip on some wine. This is good. Um, the second thing that you guys said must fall in 2021 are filler sneakers. Filler sneakers. Filler sneakers. Don't get me wrong. I own a pair. I own a pair of. I own a pair of filler sneakers, and I I like them. Like I really like them. But the problem with filler sneakers is that the problem comes when you start wearing it sky uniform. It toma how it's a feel like how uniform every day go like a feel every day how you go corner every day how you go mo na thing ki feel how you go greking ki feel how you go campus ki feel how you you know like it's overrated it's boring like if you are thinking of buying a filler a board like fillers were nice like you know last year yeah last year. I think the filler trend started like 20, 2016, 17, no, 2018, 19, you know, that's when the filler trend started. But that's like overrated and like, um, the people who have fillers are wearing them like every day. Like, you know, it's like getting annoying. It's, it's, it's getting boring, you know, like, 
it's getting boring. Don't get me wrong. I own a fillers sneaker. I own fillers. I love my fillers. But the problem is when you guys make it uniform. That's like the only problem. Otherwise, um, a fillers sneakers are comfortable. Most people say they're heavy. And it's those people that don't own them. Like people who don't have fillers sneakers, they just look at them and say, Yo, are those shoes look heavy? And they're not. They're the most comfortable shoes that you can own. But a bot. If you're thinking of buying a fillers sneaker, please move on to something else. Maybe a Vans at least. But don't buy a fillers sneaker because it's overrated. And it's a uniform. I don't know what it's a uniform. It's a fila uniform. So, no. No, a bot like how they click and give feel a how they go when I think you feel a how they go campus you feel a how they go you feel a one so no a bot a bot no that like don't like we don't want to see those gum boots anymore like I mean I'm gonna continue wearing mine <laughs> but in 2021 baby girl baby boy don't wear a fella um let's check out the fats. Le check a le fatik and if you let out complain a hore hore on so complain a hore on a lady potho look and take a lona kilona that to very feel like by sandy potho mustrating so don't don't even buy the fillers need don't about um the third <laughs> um another trend that you guys are doing and I like agree with this one like I hundred percent agree durags i hope i said it right durag durags those tights that you wear on your head no no abort <laughs> don't wear durags in 2021 we don't want to see wait till the problem with durags getting there like people who wear durags is did i say durags durags G-rags, G-rags. The people who wear G-rags are people with small heads. <laughs> that is the problem. You have a small head, but you want to wear a G-rag. It will tip a cohoes. So, no. In 2021, please, guys. I don't even know where G-rags come from. G-rags must fall. They must fall. They must fall. Oh, I don't even know where they come I think it's fine for people in America but you South Africans <laughs> y'all just it's not nice rather wear a bandana rather wear a bandana so Jurex must fall I don't even know where they come from like who created them like why 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 so Jurex must fall I 100% agree with that they must fall. Another trend that you guys say must fall is light room presets. Like it, like it, you know, very light room preset. You all know yourselves. Um, the problem is that now, that is the problem. We don't see y'all in your pictures. Like, halisabonala. Y'all like overdo it and it's so not nice. Yes, you might feel like huh, it's doing the things, but it's not. Trust me, it's not. Hagasalebona, y'all look like ghosts in your pictures. Like, it's just too much. So can we just refrain from, you can have Lightroom just to enhance your picture, but not to like overdo it. And then now Hagasalebona got your pictures out. You like blur. We don't see what's going on. So like refrain from using Lightroom presets. Some of y'all are doing the most and they like it. Like it, like it, oh, kaba out. Like it, you don't have room presets. Like it's not nice. Like don't even know. Uh uh. uh. It downy, it rainy, more morning. It whine, it's in you guys. Like it's really getting to me. I hope my lipstick still looks good. Anyway. Another trend that you guys said must fall is white Air Force ones. White Air Force. Um, white Air Forces. I don't agree with that one. 
I don't agree with that one. This is not filler. Remember, this is not filler. This is an A force. This is a Nike, baby. I don't agree that Nike Air Force must fall because simply because a Nike Air Force is like an, a classic. Yes, it's a classic. Like classic shoes can't fall, baby girl or baby boy. Like classic shoes such as your Vans, your your Nikes. Um, what else? Uh, your Vans, your Nikes, your Jordans, those are like classic shoes, and they just come for all stars, all stars. They come for whatever you do, whatever might come in fashion, whatever might go out of fashion, they stay. So you cannot say that white Air Force, uh uh, everybody's wearing them, yes, but we still want people look good in them, you know, like people, you can rock a white Air Force with everything, like skirts. Um, actually, you can rock it with everything because if you want to be a screw screw, you rock it. If you want to be a lady like, it still looks good on you. If you want to be, you know, it still looks good with any look. So I don't agree that um, white Air Force should go out. Like we want to see that more in 2021. We want to see more outfits coming out, you know, um, with the white Air Force because I feel like you can rock it with anything. It's really a cute shoe. Um, the ones that can fall, maybe it's the, the colored ones, the ones that are coming with the colors. I mean, nah. That's not cute. You know, you know which one should fall. Nike and JMLA Ewe guys, according to me, you know that Nike shoe. It's like a Nike Air Force, like you know, but it has like orange. It has Nikes everywhere. It's Nike, 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 and it's like orange, orange Nikes and black Nikes. Like it's so not nice. Even the laces and like, like it's uh, like I just want to vomit when I see that shoe. I don't like it. Like it's not nice. If you have it, maybe you should burn it. We don't want to see it in twenty twenty one. And another thing is that Anguas we go yela. Utole moto a perisa tasi une a perisa tasi o hafeza moto a ting a barika kajeri si pinki li li buruho bublu a baite like the problem is that anguas we go get so just stop it you know anguasi another trend that you guys say it should fall is guys dyeing their hair blonde during December during the festive season. Niggas, stop. Stop it. Like I don't like I don't like it. Um I feel like is Katsakona says Pelile. Like we are moving on into 2021. Uh, I mean we are in 2020 and if you still you are a guy out there that's still thinking of dying their hair blonde, then you should think again because it's not cool, it's ugly, it's overrated, it just makes you look childish, it makes you look like a, a straight meat. I'm a fail pop nana. Like, got all straight meat. No. Here's a story, guys. Like, I once dumped a guy because he was going in that direction. He used to die. His hair. He still does it right now. And I'm just like, you think I'm gonna get it down with you with that childish hairstyle? No. <laughs> no. I don't do niggas who dye their hair blonde. I like my men with a fresh black cut. That's it. Keep it simple. You a nigga. Why are you trying to compete with me? Why are you trying to dye your hair? It's nice for girls, but why are you trying to dye your hair? Why are you trying to compete with me? Like, who's the most prettiest mirror mirror on the wall? Who's the most prettiest? But no, I'm not going to date a nigga that dyes their hair blonde. No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Like... So no, no. Another trend that you guys said should fall is um dramatic lashes. No, I do not agree with that because 2021 our lashes are gonna be like this. When I talk to you, I'm gonna be like this, you know. Like 2021, I'm going to campus be like being like this, you know. 2021, I'm rocking long lashes. 2021, I am. I am just flying. I believe I can fly with my lashes. You understand? No. 2021, we are rocking dramatic lashes. If you don't own a pair of dramatic lashes in 2021, see ya, go see ya. No. So I don't agree with that one. 
Um, dramatic lashes are not gonna fall out of fashion, baby. They're actually improving in this year. So no, it's 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 one trend that I don't agree should fall. Uh, um, another trend that you guys say should fall is neon colors. Neon, oh, oh neon, ne neon. Uh -uh, no. Okay, you can do it on your nails, you know, you can pop on your nails, but clothing wise, no, Miguel, no, 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 we are not doing that. Imagine you come in an event, you think you're gonna be, I don't know, a what, you're gonna be shining there in your green or your pink New York color, and <laughs> you're just gonna look boring, let me say that, because neon colors, we did it, we done it. We're over it, you understand? Like, we are over neon colors. We don't, <laughs> you know, like, no. We are over that. 2021, it's more subtle colors. Ritamaka body, light colors. Ritamaka nako. Neon colors. You can do it on your nails, it's fine. But clothing wise, chehe, one is so. Chehe. Unless you wanna go to the moon. moon <laughs> they don't even wear neon colors on the moon i think they wear white or blue unless you want to go to the moon with your neon colors you can namela rocket shoot for the stars and get not neon shoot for the stars december and harvatlo bona neon next year so please Trend and I've been seeing this a lot. It does not have to do with fashion, but it's talking about people's weight, like commenting on people's weight gain or weight loss. Stop it, stop it, stop it. You know, like in a day or in a week, you'll get well, my five people coming up to you, oh, you've gained weight. The other one, oh, you've lost weight. Ah, oh, you've gained weight. Oh, you know, five people tell you five different things, you know, and you're just like, like it's really depressing for people to come up to you and tell you about your weight. It's really depressing for me personally. If you're gonna tell me, oh, you've lost weight, like I'm already skinny. If you're gonna tell me that I've lost weight, imagine how I'm gonna feel like. I'm gonna feel like I'm 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 anorexic or whatever, you know. So don't refrain from talking about people's weight maybe you can talk about someone when they are not there but please don't talk to me about my weight when i'm there in the room especially with with a group of people i would understand when it's one-on-one -on -one, but if it's a group of people and you comment on my weight we're gonna have a problem <laughs> we're gonna have a problem because now you're embarrassing me in front of the masses even though it's not in front of the masses man just stop commenting on people's weight because nobody's commenting on your weight. And if Nanka comment on weight in your house, you can't So let's not. I think I'm getting angry. I think it's this way. <coughs> Guys, I took a huge gulp. And now you're coming. This one is strong. It's called Hruet Constantia. That's why I'm in so. But anyway, let's continue before I die because I'm about to die. I'm about to die. Another trend that you guys said should fall is carrying fake Louis Vuitton bags. Actually, can I just add my two cents on that? Stop carrying fake Louis Vuitton bags. Stop wearing fake Gucci belts. Stop it, team. We see you. We see you. We see you. Listen, we see you. Guys, not me. Me now, my combos must communicate. Like, if I'm carrying a Louis Vuitton bag and I'm wearing a Gucci belt, obviously I'm getting into a G wagon, like, or a Mercedes Benz or a BMW, top of the range, you know. Obviously, <laughs> obviously. But now, imagine now, Mogela in a Gucci belt, Louis Vuitton bags, Gucci shades, Birkin bag, what what bag, you know? Like, it does not make sense. How fits up all taxi? How fits up all your taxi? Ulopalama any? 
What is the meaning of it? Like someone explained to me how, how people feel comfortable. Maybe, I don't know, maybe it's my character. I don't know, maybe it's me, you know. But, uh, uh, fake brands. And then, kilo palamate kisi. Or, no, like guys, rather wait until you can afford something rather than buying fakes. Maybe it's because me and I respect myself. Like, I wanna, when I'm carrying a Louis Vuitton bag, I wanna carry, you know, a real one. A one that I bought straight from Coco Centene. You get people, like, I'm not even shaming people. You get people, we got a little fellow, it's one bonaga pambunyan. And then I was like, got LV bag, I go small street. Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton, un grey, un grey, qui a perri Louis Vuitton, bec, et a cause multi to un cap, un cap, un cap, un cap, un cap, un grey, un grey, qui a perri. Ah, baby girl, you are the plug. Anyway, guys, I'd rather wait until I have money to buy real stuff real premium stuff than to embarrass myself and buy fake things so yeah guys that is it for today that is it from me for today i hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as i enjoyed taking this video please don't forget to subscribe and like this video and ring the notification bell not to miss anything that i post until next time from me to you mwah.